Welcome back, friends and family, to another fun-filled but short episode of Craig and Terry's Adventures. In this video, we go someplace and do something that we've talked about many times amongst ourselves, but there always seemed to be a reason or excuse why we wouldn't visit it. This place is Wesley Bullen Park in Phoenix, Arizona. But on the way to the park, we got sidetracked by the Mine and Mineral Museum just down the road from the park. That's a bucket from a, an excavator. Arizona has a very deep history of mining, as this museum goes into detail about. Unfortunately, the museum was closed, but it's definitely worth visiting in the future. That's bigger than our living room. This tire was used on the above style truck at the Cerrito Mine, south of Tucson, Arizona. It was one of the largest tires that can be used on these mine trucks due to the physical size. This tire was retired due to a rock that penetrated the seven inch thick rubber tread and could not be plugged or repaired. The tire is a Michelin type E4R size 55 slash 80 R63 XD. KD1. Serial number is long. The physical dimensions are 12 feet 3 inches in diameter and 50 inches wide. The tire weighs approximately 10,000 pounds and is pressurized with approximately 100 pounds of air when in service. The total tire thickness, including the tread, is approximately 7 inches. The truck weighs 1,230,000 pounds and can carry 680,000 to 720,000 pounds of payload. It has a gross power, 3,400 horsepower, and can travel at a maximum speed of 40 miles per hour. The tire was donated to the Arizona Mining and Mineral Museum by Sierrita Mine, Phelps Dodge, and Purcell's Western States Tire. That's a big tire. Did you want to stand next to it? Louis Grand Tire. Dinosaur poop. <laughs> <laughs> and still fresh. Oh, fossilized wood. Yep. Same over there. More fossilized wood. So that must be dinosaur poop. I thought this was a playground. It is. They just want to cheat. Wallow Mine Stamp Mill. Wow, there's a whole. We, we gotta come back to do this museum. <laughs> When's it open? I don't know. I don't even know if it's open with COVID going on. 
I didn't realize this, there was a museum down here like this. Well, no, it's like the Mineral and Mining Museum. Oh, okay. Arizona Copper Company's locomotive number two. Bora's head frame. Huh. Interesting. That's where we're going to head over there. Looks like there's some kind of pep rally or something going on. It's a Trump Pence rally. Really? You didn't see all the people carrying signs? Well, I saw people, but I didn't know that, that was what they were doing. Good question. Instead of down where the people crossing is. So why is Wesley Bullen Park in Phoenix, Arizona such a draw for us? Well, that's because it houses the anchor, one of the guns from the USS Arizona and the USS Arizona's flagstaff, as well as a gun from the USS Missouri. So I'm cutting this video short for reasons that you'll see in the next video where I go into depth of what is actually at Wesley Bullen Park in Phoenix, Arizona. So stay tuned for that video. And if you want to know when it comes out just go ahead and smash that subscribe button down below and remember to hit that bell to be notified when that video does come out as always if you like this video go ahead and give it a thumbs up and leave a comment down below thanks for watching